yo what one guys gemini there again back with another banger gameplay today's video will be featuring the shorty shotgun or popularly known as the 725 in modern warfare this shot was once as into the game as a lucky draw as you can see here shorty last resort lucky draw and also a free version in the event seasonal event um sad off shenanigans you guys could go ahead and complete a series of challenges and you get it i think at the sixth challenge so here it is now it's glory now stats wise in comparison to the hso as you can see the hso has a lot more advantage the only big major difference is that the hso has a cooldown timer in comparison to the shorty you could legit spam it and you it's, it's not even broken if you have to spam it because it only comes with two bullets as the base ammo count and even with a extended mod in battle royale for those who play battle royale, even with extended mod purple or blue or otherwise you cannot get more than two shots additionally to the two that was already there so in total you only got four shots in total and you cannot run void mod and shotgun so yeah you only got four shots so you gotta hit all your shots and the damage on this thing isn't the best also so i mean it makes it balanced but i think it's a bit of a underwhelming shotgun in, in comparison to how it is in modern warfare I feel like the damage can be upped a bit to match the HSO because the HSO is still better in every way. If you guys watch my previous gameplay, you'll see that I mentioned that the HSO is better in every way. Ammo count, damage, and overall, it's just better. Only downside, as I said, is the uh, fire rate because HSO has a cooldown timer. That being said, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my class setup that I think is the best class setup for Battle Royale. And I would recommend running um, extended mod. I know the slider mod is useful in Battle Royale for like this HSO and other shotguns. But for this particular shotgun, you definitely need to run a extended mod. You know what I'm saying? So here's my class setup. I have the Marauder Suppressor. You really need this on all shotguns if you're gonna build a shotgun build. Um, it gives damage at read, it is bullet spread accuracy, hit fire bullet spread. Also, another thing I forgot. This shotgun has one of the worst hip fires I've ever seen, bro. The hip fire is actually garbage, not gonna lie. Like, it's not even with the a good hip fire build, it, 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 it seems like it's not hitting anything. So, yeah, I would recommend you running ADS build or ADS in with the shotgun medium range or if you can. If you're in a situation where you have to hip fire, then you can go ahead and then you're gonna see in the gameplay um, further on down that I actually hip fire. But I would definitely recommend ADS in with this thing. Moving on, MIP, laser, hip fire, and sprint to fire delay. I kind of give it a bit of a boat to balance each. I give it a bit of a hip fire buff and also sprint to fire so I get like faster ADS. Strike four grip, it is boost spread accuracy and vertical recoil. OWC stable for that ADS bullet spread accuracy and RTC steady stock for that flinch you don't want to flinch when you're hitting shots as i said you only have two for the base ammo count and four for the additional if you're an extended mod so you want to ensure that bro you hit all your shots so i'll definitely run this steady stock so that is the class setup um i hope you guys give it a try let me know what you think enjoy the rest of the gameplay take care of yourself take care of your family stay tuned for more content peace out
Surprise, motherfucker. Get your ass back here, boy! Oh, hi, Mark. Think I'm about to steal! Nope. Catch it, bitch! That's it, I'm out of here.
Watch out. K9 unit incoming. Get your ass back here, boy! I think I'm about to skip! Try me, bitch. Get the rest over. I've got you in my sights.
Oh, brother, this guy stinks! 